The presence of Indian Foreign Minister Subramanyam Jaishankar at the inauguration of Iranian President Ibrahim Raisi in Tehran this week might simply be a matter of protocol and an unremarkable expression of mutual goodwill. But as Afghanistan descends into crisis following the withdrawal of US forces, New Delhi's long-term calculus on the regional balance of power is nudging it towards stronger strategic cooperation with Tehran. Iran appears eager to reciprocate. When Jay Shankar was in Tehran last month on his way to Moscow, Rezi received him, making him the first foreign minister of any country to get that opportunity and signaled the Iran's interest in stepping up cooperation with India. And in recent weeks, New Delhi and Tehran have intensified consultations on rapidly evolving situations in Afghanistan. Drawing India and Iran closer are common concerns about Taliban Sunni extremism and their possible return to power in Kabul now that United States is ending its military presence. So is the shared determination to prevent Pakistan's hegemony over Afghanistan, which would not only profoundly alter the geopolitics of South and Central Asia but have repercussions in West Asia as well. On the flip side, New Delhi and Tehran have divergent perceptions on the US role in the region. India's strategic partnership with the United States have deepened in recent decades. At the same time, as the confrontation between Washington and Tehran has escalated. Similarly, India's relation with the United Arab Emirates and Saudi Arabia have intensified in recent years, while Iran and its Gulf Arab neighbors have increasingly been in conflict. India has also gotten closer than ever before to Israel, even as the hostility between Jerusalem and Tehran has intensified.